Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to understand the demo of fire detection system using deep learning algorithms. As far as the fire detection in buildings or in schools or any shopping complexes is concerned, it is uh, done using some sort of sensors and then uh, the fire extinguishers are used to activate uh, or to control that particular fire. Now here we are proposing a system which will use the cameras and instead of having the separate system of uh, the different different sensors we will have we can take use of the existing CCTV cameras which are already there in the in such premises for example in any building there are already so many CCTV cameras are there and almost in every room we can find the CCTV cameras are there so entire uh, area is already covered by CCTV cameras so here what we are proposing so we can install this fire detection system or this kind of algorithm in existing CCTV camera network and in that case the additional expenses of having this sensor network can be uh, avoided and that can be a low cost solution plus the second uh, advantage of this system is uh, as far as the sensors are concerned they cover limited area in that room so in a single room you should install multiple sensors in order to accurately detect the fire but here in this case we can have a camera which is covering a wide uh, area and because of that uh, it will be a cost effective solution Again, uh, as far as the backend is concerned, we are using the uh, Flask framework of Python, SQLite database, and also the Python programming language. And at the front end side, we are using the Bootstrap framework and HTML, CSS, and JavaScript coding to code the front end application. So let's run the project. So once the project is in running condition, so you will have to hit localhost colon 5000, and then you will see uh, this kind of interface initially. Now here you can log in or you can register. So if you are having account, you can log in or you can register. So also right directly you can uh, sign in or you can log in from here. Otherwise you can click on sign up also. So if you click on sign up, then uh, here you need to provide your email address, username and uh, the password. And if you click on sign in, then you should provide your email address. And so already I have registered my account. So I will directly click on login. So once I log in, so this particular page will open where we can actually do a couple of things. Now, first of all, there is an option to book and demo. So we can actually uh, put our details and anybody can book that. So this is just a study information. Otherwise, some th this kind of information about the fire detection system uh, is provided. Also, uh, you can watch a video also. So there is some uh, demonstration video which we have linked that's the from the video and then the most important thing is that you can click on this and go to the system and then the system will start so we have integrated some calendar over here and uh, this is the various cameras uh, the camera one camera two camera three and so on so right now we have given same uh, video input to all the cameras but it can be different now you can see uh, whenever the fire is detected uh, it will also speak and it will just find where the fire is detected it will just uh, put the bounding box around that fire and it will also speak that the fire is detected and its view can be changed so it can be like this or even it can be like this also so uh, the view can be changed and the different different uh, cameras can be used so now as you can see here this is a fire is detected on this camera and uh, it has added the bounding box and also it is speaking continuously that fire is detected okay Okay, so uh, that's the complete implementation of this particular project. This is using the deep learning algorithm, like uh, it's using the YOLO object detection technique to detect the fire and uh, also the text to speech conversion technique to speak whether the fire is detected or not. And uh, of course, the front end is designed in Bootstrap using HTML and CSS technique. And also the back end is the programming, main programming language is Python and uh, the Flask framework of Python is used in this particular project. So first of all, we are training uh, this uh, kind of fire images. So model is trained on so many images where, where the fire is having uh, in that there is fire. And based on that, the model is trained using YOLO object detection or that kind of algorithm, which is CNN based algorithm. 
and once the model is trained then we are in uh, integrating that module in this system and then uh, the whatever the images are coming from that video that are given to that uh, trained model and then it is predicting once we get the prediction then the outcome is converted to speech using text to speech conversion uh, technique so that is the complete flow of implementation of this particular project so in case you need any kind of support or code of this particular project then you can check the description box under this video thank you